Thank you for joining me on the Just Talk with Rachel Nekati. And today let's talk about your personal growth. Your personal growth is your personal responsibility. There is no better time to start working on your personal growth than when you want to move out of your comfort zone. When we speak of a personal growth, we are basically talking about you taking ownership of who you want to be, you taking ownership of how you want to show up in your life. More often, people outsource their personal growth either to their employer, either to their spouses, either to, to any other person except themselves. When you want to know what exactly you need to do to become a better version of yourself, you need to be very honest. You need to be aware of your life right now. Are you happy with what you know? Or have you long stopped learning by the time you finish from high school or university? Personal growth is something that is ongoing. There is no a stop or start date. It is a decision where you are intentionally choosing to be a better person, to be better than you were yesterday. It's never too late to become a better person. Your thinking, your emotions, your actions might be needing attention right now. You might not be aware of how you are showing up. Maybe you should ask feedback. Which areas do I need to work on? If I should be a better spouse, if I should be a better sister, if I should be a better friend, what should I do differently? Only when we solicit feedback, because when you are soliciting feedback, you are basically heightening your self-awareness. Because when you talk about self-awareness, we're talking about who you are, your pattern of behavior, and also how other people see you. You might be sitting on many blind spots that warrants you taking the step towards investing your time on personal development. There is so much information. There are so many books. There are life coaches. This is your time to take ownership of your personal growth and personal development. Do not outsource. You are never too educated. You are never too old. You are never too young to grow as a person. We are always growing. We are always becoming, whether you like it or not. But some of us, we grow with the programs that no longer serve us. Some of us, we are becoming elderly in terms of our age, but in terms of the programs, our thinking, our actions, feelings, and behaviors, we are still five-year-olds. What programs needs upgrade? Once you've identified areas that you need to work on, you only do best to do a sort analysis. What obstacles are you likely to encounter on your journey of personal development? How are you going to mitigate those obstacles? Because if you've got a plan in place, when you encounter those obstacles, you'll be ready to work on a plan to overcome them. Encountering obstacles does not mean you are a failure. Life has got challenges. Just like when you are driving on the road and you see that there is a detour, what do you do? Do you come back home and say, no, I cannot go to my destination? Of course you don't. You look for alternative routes. Similarly. When you are embarking on your personal journey to become a better version of yourself, you are going to encounter challenges. You are going to encounter naysayers. You are going to doubt your capabilities. You are going to wonder whether you are doing it right. However, when your why is strong enough, when you are convinced from inward, when you know why you want to do it, there is nobody who can stand on your own way. Nobody. There is nobody who can stand in your way. You will not allow people's comments, people's sarcasm, people um, limiting statements to make you stop. Your personal growth 
is your responsibility. What programs needs upgrade? Even with technology, upgrade your system, upgrade your computer, upgrade your phone. How about you upgrading yourself? Well, that is food for thought. Which area of your life needs an upgrade? There are many tools. There are many platforms. What you simply need to do is to make an honest self-analysis. Solicit feedback. Do not defend yourself. When others are giving you feedback, that's how you come across. You will do well to listen. Even if you don't agree, just appreciate what they are saying because they might be seeing that which you don't see. And it is entirely up to you. If you want to improve your interpersonal relations, relations with others, if you want to improve your relationship with yourself, you need to invest in personal development. You need to grow yourself. Some programs are obsolete. Upgrade your system, upgrade your life. This is your time to just shift and become the best and better version of yourself. Thank you very much. If you have not done so, please subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss out on this amazing discussions. See you next time.